Good morning, fishy folks. Happy Fry Fry Friday. It is about 4 a.m. The alarm went off at 3.01 a.m. Uh, I got the car all packed up, as you can see. Um, I'm on my way to Connecticut to the Northeast Council Convention, the NEC. Um, I just stopped at Wawa to get gas. Yes, Wawa for all you non-East Coast, Pennsylvania, New Jersey-ish folks. Wawa. Um, I was supposed to go up yesterday, uh, but I guess early last week I decided um, I was going to not leave until this morning, uh, basically to save one night hotel stay, um, and I'm crazy, and the real reason is uh, one of my good friends at work is going back to Japan, and his going away party was Thursday night, and I didn't really want to miss it, so... Got home from the party around 9.30, tried to go right to bed, about 1 o'clock, I think I closed my eyes finally, and the alarm goes off two hours later. So, it's going to be a long day for me, it's about, like I said, a three and a half hour drive, and uh, I'm on my way, I have two, two cups of coffee, and uh, yeah, I'll fill you in as I get there. See you soon. Well, hello again, fishy folks. <clears throat> it's now 7.15 in the morning, and I have arrived at the hotel where the NEC convention is. Gotta be honest, I'm pretty tired. Uh, I decided I wasn't gonna stop until I crossed the George Washington Bridge. That was like a goal. And then, I don't know if you know anything about the highways uh, going north from the George Washington Bridge, but they're crazy turns, lots of traffic, lots of merging. Um, people don't know how to merge. Merge! It's a zipper, people. Anyway. Uh, I'm going to go inside and kind of check out uh, if I can get into the room, the vendor room to set up and uh, do some of that stuff. If I can, I'll probably start filming right away so you can see what I'm setting up. You can see my suitcase has shifted from uh, somebody that doesn't know how to drive in front of me. We'll talk about that later. And I'm rambling because I'm pretty tired, so I'm going to go inside. I'll be back later. All right, fishy folks, I still can't get in. Doors are locked. Registration isn't until 8, it's about 7.30, 7.40. I think this is where we are, because it's all, all day. Here's some of my stuff. <clears throat> I brought five 10 gallon tanks, five different species of guppies, or not species of guppies, but strains of guppies. All my stuff is in there, shirts, cards, stickers, equipment, nets, stuff like that, bags. And then those five buckets have water. Five gallon buckets, about 90% full, so we'll say a little more than four gallons each, which means I can only fill these tanks up halfway. Then I'm gonna grab water from here, the hotel, and uh, just add a little bit at a time, slowly acclimate. In case the water's different. All right, I'm gonna unload this stuff and go get the rest of my stuff. All right, fishy folks, trolley number two. Uh, big styrofoam has fish in it, more tanks. This is a sign, which you'll see when I set it up. Here's the stand for the sign that I made. This whole bucket is filled with java moss. We'll have a special here, which you'll see soon. Uh, a trio of guppies and a small portion of java moss, $30. Great deal, show special only. All right, I'm gonna go uh, get the rest of my stuff, like my computer bag and some other stuff, and then go park the car and uh, see if I can check in. I'm sure I can't, but it doesn't hurt to ask. So uh, hopefully the next time I start filming, I'll be setting my booth up. All right, fishy folks, I'm set up. It took about an hour. Uh, the tables aren't very steady, so I couldn't put anything on the edge over here or over there. You can see this tank is leaning crooked. Uh, but let's see what we have. We'll start over here. We have the Royal Blue Michael's Fish Room t-shirt for sale, only $20. We have half black red jade head guppies. $20 a pair. Uh, 
also breeding special. Trio, two males and a female, small portion of Java moss, only $30. Cobra guppies, so just some lemon cobras in this tank. And uh, I'm gonna call these lime cobras, but they're just pale green. I do have uh, red cobras, but I don't have a tank for them, so hopefully I'll sell out of something and then I'll add them in. Michael's Mutts, five dollars each, five for 20. And then the Jarwee Farm Lazuli Guppy, which hopefully will color up soon. I hear you talking to the fish. <laughs> so the vendor room is still pretty empty. It doesn't open for another hour for customers. I'm quite surprised there aren't any other vendors set up. A couple of people set up last night. Um, there's a bookseller over there from Canada. Nice guy. Uh, this is a silent auction. People donate fish and they raise money for some conservation groups. And that's how that works. And there's a... There's an aquascaping contest up here. Apparently it only had eight entries, so not too many. Let's take a look. Just some small tanks here. And this one is really nice, of course. I like it a lot. And this one is also very nice. So, all right, well, as things, uh, as things progress, I'll take some more video. See you guys soon. All right, fishy folks, my microphone battery went dead and I'm not prepared, so. I hope this sounds okay. Uh, a little bit after 11, Zoom Ed's all set up. Greg Jones over at my aquarium box is all set up. Nancy with the Pleco Caves over there. She's uh, used to be part of my my uh, local club, the JS Jersey Shore Aquarium Society, JSAS, where I filmed last week. But uh, she has uh, since resigned her position. So the room's filling up. There are a couple of people would have stopped by, a couple of people looking, but really not a whole lot going on yet. It's still early and it's Friday. So uh, let's take a walk and see what we got. This is the vendor room. And there's somebody coming in with all kinds of stuff. And you know, typical hotel setup, lots of ballrooms or conference rooms. Upside down. It's sticky. Let's go over here. So here is some signage. All about the NEC and the map and all the meals that you have to pay for. And there are speakers and stuff. I won't be in any of those. I'll be sitting at my table, hopefully selling guppies. And here's the registration room. People registering, getting their t-shirts and stuff. Stuck in here. There's Sherry being loud awesome. again. Look, she's waving. Sherry's gonna keep on waving to you. <laughs> <laughs> and over here we have the New England Fancy Guppy Association show. They got this thing dialed in pretty good. Airlines. And they filled those tanks up and they have the stands. <laughs> pretty good job. So that's it for now. Um, there's going to be speakers and stuff tomorrow and or later on today and tomorrow on Sunday. I won't be at any of those stuff. That stuff. Obviously, ZooMed's a big sponsor. It's a great poster, actually. And so, uh, yeah, that's it for now. Hope you guys liked it. I'll uh, hopefully make some more video for you for tomorrow. And uh, if you're in the area, come see me. We're in Rocky Hill, Connecticut. I'm here till Sunday. See ya. Well, good morning, fishy folks. Happy Fry Fry Friday. It is 3.58 a.m. My alarm went off at 3.01 a.m. 
to uh, drive up to Connecticut. It's about a three and a half hour drive from my house for the Northeast Council Convention, the NEC. Um, I was supposed to go up um, yesterday. Oh, gas is ready. Hold on. I'm, voila, stand by.